Hi everyone, Clark from Thrive Physical Therapy and Wellness in Richmond, Virginia, and this is your weekly video segment, Strive to Thrive, uh, designed to help improve your health, increase your success, and help you thrive in life. So we've been talking about the six basic human needs as a scaffolding, and it's, it's a really good solid uh, way of kind of categorizing the different needs that we have. Uh, and we said that those six things were, first, certainty, safety, security, consistency. Uh, the next is variety. The next would be significance, then connection, and then growth, and then contribution. So how well we reach those needs or serve those needs through our life is very much part of the emotions we experience on a daily basis and how happy and fulfilled. Uh, and they're very shaped by our values. So if you value family time and connection very highly, well then that's obviously something that uh, is really important to you. You want to live authentically to that and have your actions on a daily basis uh, move you towards kind of filling up that particular part of one of your needs. So the thing to think about is one of those what are what are most important to you and then of that how do you what vehicle do you use to achieve it so in other words what do you need to have to feel secure uh, or certain certain about finances certain about home certain about relationships whatever that would be um, if connection is important what do you need to uh, feel that how do you how do you serve that do you serve that consistently and regularly do you spend time with friends rather do you make time chiseled out for family how do you what what methods do you uh, serve that and then the other piece so your vehicle so to speak you want to shape what you do based on things that you really value but you also want to think a little bit about what methods you use to achieve it and then with our vehicles our methods we achieve there are frequently rules around that so what do I need to feel a certain way? What do I need to feel connected? Uh, and sometimes those rules uh, can serve us or hurt us. So one of the things is, is to try to not have a whole lot of rules around how you maybe feel connected. How does your spouse meet some of those needs? How do we judge those things? So, so anyway, things to think about. Uh, to be aware of those six needs and also give some thought to how you serve those six needs. And lastly, what, what vehicles do you use to achieve them? And what rules around that do you have? So anyway, good things to think about, uh, being aware of our basic motivations uh, when we understand what's important to us and, and basic motivations. Uh, and then becoming aware of how we serve them or don't serve them, how we can shape what we do. And then give you some thought to what rules do we place around that. Uh, and then ultimately trying to have those rules be as flexible as possible. Uh, and uh, be aware that different people serve those things in different ways. Uh, and that uh, we judge and measure based on, our, on some of our, our own rules. And uh, trying to uh, make those as, as flexible as possible. So anyway, lots of things to think about. Hope everybody's out enjoying this, this cool day and uh, exercising. So... Thanks for listening, everybody, and uh, have a great day. Keep on thriving.